Bullshit. Now. Wow, Rochelle, you're smart. Not really. <sighs> They're on the fucking table and they didn't invite me. That's smart of you guys, really. That's just great. I'm sorry. Oh, fuck. Kill him. Wow. As you can tell, I'm not very happy with some people. I died, pretty much. <laughs> oh. I don't get it. It's just like, why would you make a stereotype that the guy has to do every fucking thing? Oh, it's your first date? Well, the guy has to pay the whole fucking deal. Me, yo. I can't fucking talk. Nope, because the guy has the money. He has the car. He has the license. He should buy the house. The girl should just stay home, do all the fucking housework while the guy goes to work. Fuck that shit. Oh, fuck that. I'm not going to melee him. I would never be a nuclear family. I hate that shit. Oh, you're the... You're the... Fuck! You're the husband of the family? Well, you should, uh... You know, go to work while the wife stays at home and does all this fucking shit. Fuck that. If I had a wife, I would never force her to stay home and take care of the house. That's fucking stupid. Who are the males back then, the 62 fucking lazy, just to stay home and clean? I hate that shit. I was learning about it in like high school, a nuclear family bullshit. It's just like, no. Oh, Spitter. Surprised I saw her. I am not really good at seeing enemies. You know, that's just me. Like, my eyes are not good in video games, but in real life, they're fucking amazing. Headshot. Uh. Fuck you. I think I'm gonna make every video of Love for Dead 2 about 15 minutes or so. And video specials will probably be like an hour long or half hour, depends. Where do I go? Didn't I come down there? From there? Of there? To there? Back there? <laughs> Fucking raining. Oh shit! Where'd he go? I, oh, he went there apparently. Fuck. Hey Charger, you're gonna fucking fail. Oh, creature charge. If you don't know what that means, then it means that Charger that just completely fucking fails. Uh. Did we? Yeah, we came through here. We went through here. Were we supposed to go up? Why would you put an escalator there if you want me to go up? Can't be right. Oh! Wow. You had me. I'll admit it, you had me. Clips, classic. I almost said this. I thought that said cunts. I'm sorry. Oh shit, it's right there. Yeah, why would you put an escalator going down? They always come for me. Would you? I had fucking kill it. Where's that fucking spitter? Can't go in there yet. Thank you. That was bullshit. Oh, you got knocked out. Uh, you're rejected. It's okay. I don't care about you. Oh, 1600 damage. Love them, 16. Alright, funny story to tell. Yesterday, oh, I got my little itch. Oh, Jesus. It's so bad. Anybody know who the race car guy is? Ooh, I'll take that. Yesterday, I went to. No. Yeah, it was yesterday. I'm sorry. No, it was.
Uh, apparently males can't reproduce, so I don't know what the fuck you're talking about. So you can't really have his children. Anyways, uh, let's go to the men's. Why are the men's bathrooms so fucking? The men and women's bathroom are so fucking. <sighs> Whatever. I don't know. Oh, oh, ho -ho. rejected. And this is the end. This is the awesome part. Okay, okay, okay. So, uh, there's a car we can obviously steal. Let me see if I can spot one. Oh, okay, okay I get it now. I was gonna ask, why not just go over there and grab the gas tanks, you know, first? Cedar's not gonna save us. Any ideas? Actually, I've been thinking. So I've just been thinking Jimmy gives stock cars around here somewhere. We just gotta find it. Anyways, I went to go get my haircut on Saturday, and this girl is, you know, she's a little bit overweight, but she's still beautiful. I mean, if I could fuck her, I would. That's how beautiful she is. Uh, I sat down, waiting for my hairdresser. I don't know who it was. So I was like, okay, I'll just wait for this girl to come. You know, come in front of me. Yeah. So, this girl starts talking to me, and, you know, she's saying, hi, Nick. I'm like, hi. You know, in the back of my mind, I was wondering, you know, how did she remember my name? But I haven't seen her in probably half a year. More than longer. Longer than a couple months. About. There's Boomer. Yeah, she just automatically remembered my name. I was like, holy shit, you actually remember my name. I gave you plus one. <laughs> and, you know, I thought she was my hairdresser. She just said, well, I'm almost done. I'm like, okay. Then this girl walks out, and there's like a nice looking blonde. And she just smiles at me. I'm like, why is she smiling at me? I don't know who she is. I'm not going to ask her out. You know? <laughs> I'm not even... I don't even know her. Oh. Why did I come up here for? That was stupid. She smiles at me. I'm like, okay. Uh, you're not my hairdresser. She is. And she goes, are you ready? I'm like, sure. <laughs> I don't know who's doing it, but you know, I'll do it. Whatever, man. <sighs> so, you know, she walks me over to where she wants me to sit down. I'm like, okay, I'll sit down if you want me to. To let you suck off my dick, but, you know, that's not going to happen, but whatever. Anyways, there's fucking four right here. That didn't happen last time. Fucking horde, that's great. And they're right there. Awesome. Awesome. Anyways, we sit down and she was fucking, I don't know. Was she like naturally blonde and not very bright or what? Because I don't know about you, but she was not very bright. Would you turn the fuck around, guys? You guys can just turn around. There you go. Was that so fucking hard? Huh? Was that so hard? Better and somehow you kill her. Pretty cool. She was. Holy shit, she's stupid. I mean, she says, uh, Are you going to college? I'm like, Yeah, I'm going to college for a while. And so I'm going to drop out. And she goes, Why? And I said, Well, it's just not for me. Fucking horror. And she said, Why do you want to drop out? I said, Because it's not for me. But why do you want to drop out? I was just like, lady, I have no idea who you are. I've only seen you a couple times here. Am I really going to tell you why I want to drop off college? No. I'm not going to. I'm just going to drop another one for, you know, for the hell of it. I could tell a random girl why I dropped out. I'm going to drop out college. <sighs> she said, where were you going for? And I said, I'm just going for computer science. At least I was. And, oh shit, are they stuck? Well, shit. Can 
Can I get that? Oh, fuck. I don't know if I can. Well, shit. I don't know if I can get that. And I, she asked, well, if you're not going to college anymore, what are you going to do? I said, I'll just get a full-time job and continue with the YouTube thing. You know, I just start saying a YouTube thing because people don't know what the fuck uh, YouTube really is. You know, you don't know what making money is off YouTube. Anyways, the whole last she goes, oh, do you hope to get on Tosh.0 someday? I'm like, no, 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 no. I am just fucking tired, so don't blame me. She said, well, what kind of videos do you make? I said, you know, just random videos. She goes, oh, are they funny videos? I'm like, yeah, they're funny sometimes. You know, they can be funny sometimes. She goes, oh, do you hope to be on Tosh.0? I'm like, no. I hate that show. It's stupid. I mean... I'm not really saying, you know, I, it's stupid or anything, but it's just not my sense of humor. I told her that it's not my sense of humor, and she goes, oh, what's your humor? You know, what's your type of humor? I said, dry. She goes, oh. <laughs> I was like, really? Hold on. Hello? I'm at home already. Yeah. Sure, I can do that. Okay. Love you too. Bye. Mm, bye. All right. Sorry about that. Just my uncle's gonna come over, drop off a. Uh, Table. I'm gonna help him. I don't know how heavy it is or not. We're gonna carry inside and we're gonna call it good. I'm gonna get that fucking. <sighs> yeah, she's just like, oh, yeah, okay. Give me that. Oh, I got it. Oh, yeah, yeah, yeah. We finished it. That was just fucking funny. I was like, no, I never want to be on Talk Point. Oh. Besides, I don't really have the really good. I don't have the content to get on Tosh.0. If it did, you know, I would never even watch Tosh.0 just to see it. Anyways, she asked where I live. I said I live here. Oh, I'm not gonna skip. I'm gonna actually gotta talk through this. She asked where I live, and I said I live in Coeur d'Alene. And she she goes, oh, do you live in a house? I said no, I live in an apartment. She goes, oh. What apartments do you live in? Sun Claire? Or some shit. I don't know what she was talking about. I'm like, no. I live in the halfway apartments. And she goes, where is that? <laughs> I'm like, oh my god, lady. I live one... I told her I live one mile away. You know, she said Sun Claire. And I was like, you know, that's not where I live. She goes, oh, okay. I told her I live in the halfway apartments. She goes, oh, where's Appleway? I'm like... It's not that far away, you know, it's, I was about to tell her it's by Lowe's, and she goes, oh, you mean by that carpet place? I'm like, yeah. She goes, oh, okay. So you live in those apartments? I'm like, yeah. The green ones? I'm like, no, they're white. I don't know about you, last time I checked my apartments, they are fucking white. They're not green. Did I say 13, or 1,444... Zombies were killed? Fuck, that's insane. <sighs> Anyways, let me finish off what I was saying. She asked if I lived in the apartments that were, or have I ever thought of living in the apartments that were like a block away from where I live? Because she said they were ghetto. Okay, I don't know about you guys, but in my opinion, when people say something is ghetto, I mean. I think that they mean it's fucking cool. I don't know what ghetto really means, but, you know, I was just thinking that. And I said, no, I would never live in a ghetto place. It's fucking stupid. I'd rather live in these. Anyways, thank you guys for watching for the first campaign series. This has been awesome. And more ranting will come. So, ugh, my name is Lap Peds. See you guys later. Boy!